If you've ever used TikTok, you know it can be addictive. That's because the app is so good at personalizing the videos you see because of how much information it collects about you. Just how much information the app collects has made it a target for American politicians. Casey Decker with our Verify National team reports on whether a new proposal in Congress could make the app illegal. Sometimes it seems like the only thing as popular as TikTok is trying to ban TikTok. For years, lawmakers have feared that because the app is owned by a Chinese company, it could give the Chinese government influence over American users and access to their data. A bipartisan group of senators just introduced a bill they say is designed to address those concerns. And the Biden administration endorsed it. But could it actually result in a nationwide TikTok ban? Let's verify. Our sources, Senate Bill 686, Senator Mark Warner, the White House, the Department of Commerce, and the Department of Justice. The bill is called the Restrict Act, and it doesn't explicitly ban TikTok, but it makes such a ban possible. It instructs the Secretary of Commerce to investigate any information technology or communications companies that are owned or could be influenced by foreign adversaries to see if they pose a national security threat. Then it gives the secretary broad authority to mitigate any dangerous transactions. So we can verify, yes, a bill currently in Congress could result in a ban on TikTok. But there are a lot of steps to get there. First, it has to pass the Senate and the House and be signed into law by the president. Then the Secretary of Commerce would have to choose to investigate TikTok specifically, find that it poses a threat, decide the best course of action would be a ban, and successfully defend that ban against legal challenges. As for how a ban would be implemented, we don't know for sure, but one option could be making it illegal for any American company to do business with TikTok. That would force Apple, Google, and others to remove it from their app stores. TikTok, for its part, says a ban would be a bad idea, calling it an act of censorship on its American users. Some lawmakers say they don't support a ban, but would like some restrictions on TikTok, which this bill could also allow. With your Verify, I'm Casey Decker. There's another way that app creators could keep it legal here in the U.S. TikTok says the White House will not ban the app if its Chinese owners sell their stake in the company. A TikTok spokesperson said the company is disappointed with the administration's threat and said TikTok has been working on solutions already, including moving U.S. user data to cloud servers in the U.S. TikTok CEO is testifying in front of a House committee next week.